Bleacher Report. Kevin Durant. Hey, Ronnie 2K. I'm getting an explanation why I'm not a 99. This has become laughable. NBA 2K. KD tra Trey 5. Is a 96 in 2K23. What do you think about this overall? I don't think he should be a 99. I don't think he's the best player in the NBA. It's also very hard to get a 99 overall. Only a few players have ever done it actively on 2K, but... What do you think about this? And should, does he deserve the 99 rating? I don't think so. He was injured for a lot of last season. And I think LeBron had a better season than he did. So I think I'll give it LeBron. Or actually, Giannis even should have it. Giannis should have the 99 rating, if anything. And so should Steph. I don't think KD deserves it at all. But what do you think about this? I think 96 is perfectly fine for him. And I don't know why he's complaining so much. Bleacher Report. They'll be playing with me. I made the playoffs last year. They didn't. Pat Pev, I'm playing with LeBron and Anthony Davis. I'm kind of confused on this comment overall. He's acting like he's going to change the whole season just by him playing with them. I don't really think this is happening. And he's overestimating his impact on the team and what's going to happen. I just don't see it really happening that way. I think they're probably going to make, might be in the playing tournament, but I don't know. The Lakers could really miss the playoffs again. I don't, I don't know what you really do after that. I think Russ would probably be a free agent after this season, so I don't really know what they're playing with that is. I think they'll probably just let him go. A lot of people already wanted them to trade Russ, which they didn't really find a partner, and I don't think they want to buy him out either. So, what's your opinion on Pat Bev? And do you think they're going to make the play on or the play or the playoffs? What seed do you think they're going to be as well? NBC claims Adidas offered a one billion dollar USD buyout. This is very interesting overall. So his other two options were either they keep him, and also his like royalties was like five hundred million, I guess, for next year or something like that. Where they buy him out, which that was another possibility as well. And then there were some other ones, like... I don't really know what he's going to do after this. This is very interesting. Is he going to take the, the deal or not? And what does that mean? Do that, Does that mean they own all his IP? Does it mean he's bought out of the deal and he can never come back? Or, like, what's exactly this involved in this $1 million buyout? Is he just gone from Adidas? I don't really know what entails all in this billion dollar buyout. A lot of money to buy Kanye out and... Very interesting story. What's your opinion on it? Complex. Several shipping containers loaded with upcoming Nike releases were seen ransacked in social media posts. An incident is said to have taken place over Labor Day weekend. Videos of ransacked Nike shipments surface online. Which there was a lot of, a lot of pictures overall of just videos of just whole rows of shoes. And overall, I don't really know what Nike's going to do with this. This is kind of a bad situation for them to happen to. I don't know what they could have really done more. How, I guess, just don't have it sitting in the middle of nowhere and someone just, like, really know what's inside of it and really take everything.